Hey everybody, it's Brad. And I'm Krista. With the Big Family Homestead, and we are on the precipice of a breakthrough. <laughs> you think I'm kidding? Right back here, the kiss of death right in the past. But this year, see what that is? I believe we have evaded <laughs> we problems. We have evaded it. We so have. He here's the scoop. In the past, how many homesteads? Four? I think I lost. I've lost count. At least four homesteads because of jobs and moving and uh, Grace's health issues. We've had to move a lot. No, no regrets. You just make the best choice you have in front of you. I had to count them. But five. the funny thing is, is that every time we we get a place, we're like, this place is awesome. This is perfect. We start planting a grove or fruit trees, and then we got to sell the place yeah. and move. Yeah. So this. Is risky <laughs> well no it's not because we planted two fruit trees last year in may we made it a year we made it almost a year so, so you make it a year i think we're i think we're good fruit trees yeah no longer the kiss of death no longer we we've broken the spell the honey crisp the broken the curse <laughs> the, yeah the, the fruit tree crisp uh curse <laughs> tris I'm, I'm getting all excited thinking about honey crisp apples right so do you guys have any similar issues or are our issues i think they're issues? unique for us they're definitely unique for us so fingers crossed these trees are going in the ground crossed. hopefully today He's here crossed. we go so one of the honeydew projects is to replace these lights they are broken and need to be replaced, so... Uh, well, they have been all winter. Yes, they have been all winter, so that's... And I would like to add that you've been very vocal about it. Yeah. Very vocal about it. Yeah. And we've been waiting to try yeah. to find the right deal. Right, find, finding the right deal, the right light to replace those with, and... Uh, yeah. Well, we found them today. They were on sale. We did. Found them today. Clearance. And uh, so we're going to fix those. Or you're going to fix those. Well, you're going to help, sister. Yeah. You're not getting out of this. I know. <laughs> we got spring chores happening. That's right. Here That's we go. Right. All right, Mama. Are you sure that uh, power's off? I don't know. Did you turn it off? I don't know. Did I? Did you? Did I? Did you? <laughs> I don't know. I did, Mama. I wouldn't do that. <laughs> Although it is exciting for just a minute. Yeah, not really. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so here's the ones that we got as the replacements. They look pretty cool. I like the water glass kind of vibe. We got the two of them. Clearance. They were on clearance, Clarence, right? Oh, that's not that's not focusing up. There we go. Beautiful face focused. Got the second one. And, uh, well, I think these are going to look great. Yeah, we kind of had to do a little bit of... Uh, sleuth work because there's some uh <laughs> creative there were some creative solutions in here let's just say that and um i think we got it down to where it's gonna work so we're just gonna uh, 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 uh. okay so we're almost done with the job and it's been fun because we keep finding fun creative fixes that that were well they were creative and they had to fix things and <laughs> you'd be nice but anyway this is something I'm cool, excited about that is super cool. Have you seen these guys? These are actually LED lights. They look like the old school antique lights, but those are LEDs. This thing only uses like four eight, and a half. Four and a half, I thought four and it was, a half watts. Yeah, eight watts or nine watts together between the two of them. Yeah. But I can't wait to show you these, but you're gonna have to wait to the next video because it's gonna be it's right dark in front of my when face. I'm sorry. That's funny. <laughs> There's mom. I didn't even notice it. In front first. Of my face. These are great. <laughs> Hi. So, but you'll have to wait till the next video because I'll be editing before it's dark, so. All right, we're all done and I know it's daytime, but I gotta go in here. You tell me if there's any fires or anything, okay, hon? Oh, okay. You, you got the extinguisher? Yeah, I shouldn't be standing this close then. On your mark, you set. Ooh, those are really pretty. Do you like them? Yeah, they look like the lanterns on ships to me. Yeah, you see the, That's the really cool. water glass? That's Did really cool. Did the other cool. one work too? Yeah. Yay, I can't wait to see what they look like in the dark. Yeah. Hey. Very cool. You know, cool. there was some creative engineering behind this wall. And uh, you know what? Hey. Behind that wall. It's okay. It's all right. We got it done. Well done. And it looks nice. Yeah. Now, driveway alarm. Okay. Next up, 
we got a driveway alarm we got to put together because we've got a really long driveway. That's why we're riding our ATV. Yeah, and it's no fun when you're sitting there watching a movie or something after a long day working, dun, dun, dun. and you're what? like, oh, who's that? Right, exactly. Because you didn't even know they were there. Right. So here we go, driveway. Hello, bashful teenager. Ready to put up a driveway alarm? Sweet. Ooh, it's wet. Yeah, it's cool. It's sloshy <laughs> down in there. A little bit sloshy. I guess we'll go a little slower. That's good. The ground wet. Hey, Caleb. I appreciate your creativity, but we got a tamping bar for that. You don't need to necessarily use a big old honking rock, bro. Hey. It's okay. We'll get the tamping bar, but good job. Okay, so uh, fingers <laughs> crossed. Yeah. This would be a big family homesteadism. We sent yeah, Hope to go get the uh, the tamp. It beeped. And she didn't know it was laying on the back of the ATV. And took off down the driveway. And, it and we saw pieces cuts. go kapoosh. Is the light supposed to light up? Hey. hey. Still works. Still works. All right. They found it. Okay, good. <laughs> All right, Grace, you got some rocks? Oh, you can mash them down in there. Just get them smooshed down in there. They'll never come out of there. Yeah, get it down in there. All right, good job. Going good, mama. Okay, here's the test. I am the would-be car traveling through. Here we go, driving. I'm way over on the edge, I'm way over on the edge. And I don't think we turned it on. <laughs> oh, kinda, kinda helps if you turn it on, huh? A little bit. A little bit. I don't, I don't know who that was. I'm gonna say it was Caleb. What? Caleb had to do it, right? It's okay. Oops, I might've just turned it off. Shoot, we'll find out. Car driving by. Victory! Yay! So this is kind of fun. Um, Mama saw the chickens coming out, hanging out right next to the house here, the deck. Yeah. And um, she ran for the cantaloupe, cantaloupe scraps. scraps. And so I threw the insides out there, and they're just going to town. They're <laughs> enjoying it. Mm -hmm. Brutus, chill out, bro. They would have gotten these scraps later on, but it's more fun for us to watch. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, guys, I am getting ready to turn on our road here, and I've got a super cool um, surprise for Mama and whoop, the whole family, because every once in a while, I was out just doing errands, and every once in a while, you run on to a, a really cool score, and I found a business that was getting rid of some stuff that, whoop, I don't want to show you yet, but that... Um, Oops, sorry. Yeah, oh, <laughs> I'm always giving away. Well, we found something that's really cool and it's gonna be nice for the house and I think mom's gonna like it too, so here we go. But it may take us just a little bit longer to get there. This guy's smoothing the road out, which yay, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll be happy to wait the extra 30 seconds to turn into the driveway. Check it out, mama. I found the coolest thing. Found the coolest thing? Is six. It the coolest thing? I found six of the coolest things. Yeah? Yeah, check it out. Score. So what do you think? I found these chairs. They're they, awesome. They, yeah, look at them. They're in really great shape. I mean, they're dinged up. They've been used. Yeah. But they cool. were uh, from the, um, the eye clinic. Cool. The eye clinic. So upgrade from our metal chairs that we've been using downstairs. And sometimes, you know, God just blesses, and so thank you. Yeah. This is gonna be great. I think somebody put gum on the bottom of this one, though. Did you just find a, a little treat, a yeah, snack I, for later? Yeah, I saw it when I when you handed it to me. I'm not touching it. There's a treat under there. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I mean, they're scuffed up, but we can fix all that. Cheers, that's fine. This is cool. Yeah. Praise God. Cool. Good job. Okay, people. So we just learned how to make real, fresh, honest to goodness, true mozzarella cheese and we're adding it to mom's pizza dough 
and mom's pizza sauce, which is all fresh. And there's mom, which she's always fresh. Yeah. So that's awesome. Right. Well, she's making them up, but I gotta show you this cheese. This is unreal, okay? Caleb, this is his pizza. Everybody usually gets their own one pizza, but look at this. Pizza's been cut already. Look at that. Whoop, you gotta get the other one. But, ah, look at that. There you go. Oh, he's losing it, losing it. Well, mm. I guess it was too hot. You're gonna have to get a fork or wait. Yeah. And Hope, she, she's bizarre. I love you, Hope, but I, that's unnatural. No, it's not. It's unnatural to put pineapples and pickles on pizza. There's no pickles. They're pickled pineapples. No. Okay, they're not. But what do you think, guys? That looks pretty legit. I gotta say, even in an oven. What do you think? Pizza oven. Pretty good? Yes. And ladies and gentlemen, for the pièce de résistance, <laughs> my pie. Take a look at that. It's still super hot. See the cheese going? Holy mackerel. And that's pizza in an oven in the house. Now, we gotta figure out the pizza oven outside wood fire because this is good. That's gonna be ridiculous. All right. I think it's time for a food coma. Food coma? Yeah. Engage. That was, I shouldn't have eaten the whole thing, but it's not good the next day. Oh, it's delightful oh, the no, next no, no, day. No, 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 no. I'm, I'm, no. Believe it or not, I'm trying to figure out can I do it? And I'm. All right, and a quick Pick update up on Clover. On Clover. Yeah, she's doing really, really good. She's eating hay, well, nibbling at hay. Uh, she's eating a little bit of grain, right. but she's. Um, we separate yep. her and her mom in during the day, so mom can be outside. Um, and then in the evening, we collect mom, you know, some of mom's milk, not all of it, because the baby needs some all night long. So. She's doing great, yeah. jumping around, being happy. Yeah. Now, we have not yet decided whether or not she's going to become a part of our herd or someone else's. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because we really don't have enough space. We do not have enough space. Um, we do not need three milk cows. Um, and she is a, uh, she can be registered and because um, she's got really good uh, bloodlines. So I guess. Yeah, we might have to find a family that, that needs, needs a milk cow and work something out, but right. but we don't want, she's definitely got, not going into the industrial she's scene. Not going no into way. the industrial scene. She's going to be a family milk cow. Yeah, so whether she's here or somebody else's family, we've yeah. yet to figure out. But um, these ladies back here are saying, hey, yeah. it's the end of the day. When are you going to milk me? Not hey, yet. hey, you, yeah. get over here, milk me. Not yet. You. Yeah. <laughs> okay, spring stuff. It seems like it's a never ending honeydew list. Oh yes. We have a list this long on paper. One time I caught a fish this big. Right. <laughs> the honeydew list is long. <laughs> it's long and actually it seems like it keeps getting longer. But... Just like Pinocchio. His nose. <laughs> no, it's it's one of those things. It's the you know you, you can't get out because there's snow piled up. You know, literally four feet six feet high. Right. And so things gotta wait. Right. Things have to wait until we have a short summer and fall, and then we get, get busy. It done. Right. Get busy. Mm -hmm. So I've got a question for you. What are you doing right now in spring on your homestead or? home garden or mini farm or whatever. The projects that are on your honeydew list. Yeah, what's your honeydew mm -hmm. list? List them down below. I wish there was a way they could put a picture or something in there. Oh, I know, that'd be cool, wouldn't it? That would be cool. Yeah. Maybe we'll have to figure something out. Maybe you guys know. can email it to us. Or go to our website. Yeah. I think there might be a way to post something there. Uh, I might be able to figure something out. Okay. Check in the next few days. I'm nerdy. I might be able to figure it out. So. I think that's going to be it because I got to go edit this video so yeah. you can watch it and look at us mm -hmm. and go, Brad, you're nerdy and yet you get things done. Mm -hmm. And mom, you're amazing. We'll go and lay down for a minute. And I, I got to edit. Mm -hmm. So I'm, I'm Brad. I'm Krista. You guys have an amazing day. Oh, and blessed day.